The Penang High Court on Friday rejected former Penang Chief Minister Lim Guan Eng, his wife Betty Chu and businesswoman Pang Lee Kun bid to strike out corruption charges involving 11.6 million ringgit foreign workers dormitory project. Judicial Commissioner Rofia Mohamad said she rejected the bid to strike out the case as there was a major difference in these proceedings compared to the original charges cited by the defence. Last year, the defence filed an application to strike out the case, citing the use of the same evidence in an unrelated case where Lim was acquitted in 2018. Lim's lawyer, R.S.N. Rea, claimed the prosecution was using evidence from a previous criminal case involving the purchase of Lim's bungalow in Jalan Pinhon despite his acquittal and discharge in 2018. When met later after the decision, Rea said they will file an appeal. Uh, so we want to study the grounds of judgment, before, but we respect the decision made by the High Court judge. Uh, we can only say uh, anything further once we have read the grounds of judgment. But uh, I can tell you that we, can, uh, we will be proceeding with the appeal uh, eventually. The three were charged under the Anti-Money Laundering, Anti-Terrorism Financing and Proceeds of Unlawful Activities Act 2001 and the Malaysian Anti-Corruption Commission Act 2009. The case revolves around a dormitory project awarded to a company linked to Pang when Lim was Penang's chief minister. Lim is accused of giving gratification worth 372,000 and 9 ringgit to Chu via Excel Property Management and Consultancy Sendirian Berhad to ensure that magnificent emblem Sendirian Berhad was awarded the project at Juru and Batu Kawan. This offence was allegedly committed between August 2013 and March 2016 when Lim was also tender board chairman of the Penang Development Corporation. Pang was charged with abetting Lim while Chu was charged with three counts of laundering the 372,000 and 9 ringgit in three tranches.